Okay, guys, it's Nico. I'm back, uh, from, well, you know, Nico from Dwarf Games again. Um, and so, I was just scrolling through my worlds here. Um, I've got several of them. Some of them aren't mine, but, anyway. Uh, so, I was gonna show you guys a couple of seeds that I found. They're pretty cool, actually. Uh, this one's one of my favorite. It's one of my favorites. Seed is warm with a lowercase w. And um, so if we create this world, um, takes a while to generate in the world. Anyway, um, so this is actually a pretty cool seed if you guys ever decide to just type it in. Oh, I've also, um, decided to start making my own skins, so I made this one. It's not the best, but up we go. Here, it's got another creeper. I, I like creepers. Um, so, if we go in this general direction, um, and you guys just You'll know if you're going in the right direction because you will see a patch of pumpkins. And we all know how much we like pumpkins, especially in pie. Mm. Anyway, um, hang on. Um, so, nah, I may have gone the wrong way, but nevertheless, if we jump down here, um, yep, there's that, then there's a tall pillar of whatever that is, dirt and stone, um, should be some pumpkins somewhere. Anyway, um, yeah. Um, sorry if I'm not talking so much, but um, trying to focus. Well, anyway, um, I'm I have this. Um, world any in another way, so I'm just gonna delete that. Um, right here. So, basically, um, what the seed is, is when you find the pumpkin patch, and then you travel for a bit, you find an exposed zombie dungeon in, like, this um, little oddly shaped thing here. So I just thought this was pretty cool. Um, and I've already looted the chests. Um, and so you get a gold record, two cocoa beans, some iron, redstone, some gunpowder, bunch of saddles, a couple buckets, and a piece of bread. You can see this little zombie guy there. So that's pretty much it for this seed. Um, not really sure what other uh, seeds there are. I, I think if I remember correctly, this was a good seed. Mojang with capital M. Um, and, yeah, so, let this, will load, save, generate, generate, load, and save, and I believe, yes, there are several squids, computer is nagging again, and,
um, I'm not sure where it is, but you spawn in this big desert, and, um, oh, uh, give me a second, floating sand must collapse. Uh, so, anyway, um, ooh, more floating sand, um, so, oh no, it wasn't floating, um, anyway, so, I, rem I remember last time I did this world, it, um, there was a bunch of clay just everywhere, Pretty much anywhere you looked, if you wandered around for a little bit, you'd find more clay. But, um, yeah, so, more floating sand, sorry. I got a bad habit of destroying floating sand when I see it. Um, so, anyway. Uh, there was a lot of clay if you look around just a little bit and I I remember the last time I tried the seed I got um, like four stacks of clay blocks or something from like seven deposits in just a short while and I completely missed the sand that I meant to collapse. So congratulations to me, because there we go. Blah, blah, blah. Anyway. Okay. Um, I'm trying to think what other worlds there are. Um, oh yeah. Um, ah. Okay, so, um, you've probably, some of you have heard of this seed before, it's Chuck Norris, and, um, what you do is you spawn in a desert, there's only a few trees around, you've got until nightfall, got to play a normal or hard, um, there's some scoring system, but quite honestly, I don't bother with making tools or any of that stuff. What I think's fun is to, um, like I, like I said, plan normal, but, um, when it becomes night, because basically what the goal is of the actual challenge is to survive the night, which, from what I've heard, is almost impossible. I don't think anyone's ever actually done it, but, um, so, what... What I like to do is, I like to go in on normal, and when it gets night, um, just try and get as many creepers as I can. Whoa. And apparently lead them into the lava pit. Um, no, that's actually not what I like to do. Ooh, pumpkin. Um, but, um, and then try and kill as many, barn uh, as many of these animals as I can. And I think I... Oh my goodness, it's a pink sheep. And I heard a zombie. Oh my goodness, look at that. Okay, I probably typed in the seed wrong. So, we'll just let these zombies um, burn. Well, not falling in. Zombies don't push. Sheep don't push me in. Um. So. Hopefully these animals will not push me in. I would like to see what is in these chests. 
Um, but I'm doubting that's a possibility because, um, because I just think it is. Zombies probably won't spawn anymore after I kill off this one here. If it will die. Do the zombie defense. Um, so, okay, so that's what's in here, um, yeah, I think I typed in the seed wrong, because, yeah, I just did, so, again, this is, uh, Miko from, uh, Dwarf Games, and, um, yeah, uh, so, See you next time. Don't forget to rate, comment, and hopefully subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.